Four and a half billion years ago, it's thought that another planet, called Theia, crashed into the Earth. It was cataclysmic. Debris from both planets clumped together to form the Moon. But where is Theia now? No one has found any evidence of it until today. A German-led team has found microscopic traces of Theia in moon rock and it's impressed researchers at the Natural History Museum in London. What we've been looking for as scientists is actually the chemical fingerprints of Thea. There should be the chemical signature of Thea in the moon rocks. And people have been looking for this for a long time. And the scientists in Germany say that they think they found it. It's trance time! 900 pounds of moon rocks were collected by Apollo astronauts in the late 1960s and early 70s. Ever since then, scientists have been searching for traces of Thea. Under the microscope is a piece of moon rock brought back by Apollo astronauts more than 40 years ago. And it's only now that scientists have found evidence of a little piece of Thea in the samples. It's taken them so long because the difference between Thean rock and moon rock is very, very tiny. That's puzzled researchers here in Oxford because according to the theory, so much of the moon was made from Thea. So why isn't there more of a difference? One explanation is that Thea actually formed close in to the Earth, or maybe even slightly further inboard towards Venus and Mercury. And until we get samples of Venus and Mercury, we won't know whether they actually do look like the Earth, and therefore this whole region of the inner solar system looks rather similar. The discovery backs the view that our Moon was formed as a result of a collision with another planet. But it raises another question. Why is there so little evidence of Thea on the lunar surface now? Palab Ghosh, BBC News.